Hey, today I'm going to be talking about United AR, an augmented reality platform that lets you create AR experience without any coding knowledge. So let's dive right into it. Once you have signed up and signed in, you'll be taken over to the project window. Here, you can manage all your projects. And over to the left, you have a couple of options we'll get that into later. So first, I'm going to click on create new experience. And now you have two kinds of detection, image detection and image detections with QR. So I'm going to click on image detection and that is going to ask me to upload a target image and it needs to be in a specific format and under a specific size. So I'm going to click on browse and select the image. I'm going to head over to downloads. I have a few lined up here and hit open. This can be anything that you've created. It could be a brochure or it could be a poster, anything of your desire. And um, all, all it matters is that it requires uh, an, a certain amount of contrast in it. So you'll get that right now. So here you can see that it's just it just has one out of five stars. Ideally, it, it will require three out of five stars, but I'm just going to move on for now and hit continue. This is a complete 3D editor and over to the left side you have all the contents. For now I'm just going to add a 3D model and I'm going to click on vehicles. You can upload your own in GLB format but I'm just going to use one from the library here and click on add and it should pop up right on top of the image. You can see that it's appeared on top of the image and I'm going to select that and scale it a little bit and when you're happy with it you can click on preview and see how it looks. You can pause the screen here and test it out for yourself. You can scan this QR code and then when the camera opens up, you can hold it on top of this image and see how the content would appear. And now if you want to use your own customized application, you can do that as well. All you need to do is use our custom AR app creator. And over here, you can give an app name. I'm going to type in just app and select an icon. I have one here, hit open and click on crop. So over here you have a lot of options. You can click on uh, circle, curvy or square. It depends on your choice. And uh, then you, ha you have a lot of options here that you can play around with uh, on customizing the application. Uh, so you can, you can customize all the aspects of the, um, the the application that you're trying to build. You can customize the AR gallery, flash button. If you want to have skins on top of this, you can add that. It all depends on your choice. It's completely flexible. And over here, you can add in the burger icon. You could, there are customization options for that as well. But for now, I'm just going to leave it as it is and click on next. And over here, you can you can you can customize the content appearance page. And again, I'm going to leave it at default. And over here, you have the help sliders. You can guide users on how to use the application, and that's done here. And I'm going to finish steps. Now, this is going to ask me which OS version would I like. I'm going to select Android because that's the easier version. And now, if you click on Generate App, it's going to take about 20 minutes to uh, create your own application. Now, if you want to customize the whole uh, web aspect or the web AR side of this, you need to go to custom web AR. And over here, you can customize the whole, um, you know, page and you can add in multiple instructions on how to use it and add in multiple pages. And if you want to add it to your own domain, you can do that by copy pasting this iframe code or if you want to have your own, uh, you know, custom web AR of Europe, but you don't mind the United Arab branding, then you, all you need to do is, you know, type in a brand name here and you're done. So I hope you guys like our product and I hope you guys try it. Thank you.